Hey, welcome to Backyard Bows. I'm Brandon, and today we're going to look at the Blade Pro Flex thumb release uh, by Trueball. They've had the blade around for a couple years. They have made some changes uh, with the Blade Pro Flex, and I think the, the minor changes that they have made have truly made this a really complete thumb release. I, I have loved it. We have several releases over there on the countertop that we just haven't got to yet. And out of all of the ones that we've tested, this one has stayed out of the packaging the longest, on the table the longest, in the, in the backyard uh, the most. It seems to be the one that I kind of have gone to for more and more and more. The more I pick it up, the more I like it. And I'll tell you a couple of the reasons why. First, the weight of the release is always something that stands out to me. Again, a lot of these things are preference, okay? But the weight is one of the first things. It's like the grip of a bow. It, it just stands out the most. Uh, this one reminded me of the Synapse, which I shot for a while, and they ended up being almost the exact same weight. Um, so it's brass with a half brass, half aluminum. They call the outside aluminum a quick silver finish. I love it, okay? It kind of adds that weight with the brass. But then the outside, you got this thing. It is great quality. One of my first things that I noticed on it is all of the detail into the gripping inlays on it. Each finger position has a different gripping inlay. You have this checkered pattern on front and back. So even though it is kind of a slicker material, all of the laser engraved gripping on it, uh, I, I think makes for a truly very comfortable release. Uh, one of the first things that they that I noticed that they changed from the blade to the Pro Flex is the thumb barrel adjustments. You have an extra piece on there which allows you to get a little bit more length to your thumb barrel. So this one release um, will truly cater to a lot of different hunters with different hand sizes. You have the adjustability of the thumb barrel, which most of them do, and then you have that length, and then obviously it swivels back and forth. So you have all of the same adjustability capabilities that most of these really high dollar releases are gonna get you. Second thing I noticed, when locking and releasing it, this is my my number one favorite feature on this, uh, and and this is this is just something that they've carried over. But the locking mechanism, a really nice big locking piece on the back of here. Okay, it's really smooth. It clicks in once it locks in. As you can see here, it's going to move that hook as it locks. So it's kind of like a spring-loaded hook, where as you lock it in, it's going to grip that string and wrap around. And once it's locked into place, again, I really like a secure release. This thing is not going anywhere. It's locked on there nice and tight. It has a safety feature in there where even if a piece of paper is gets between that hook, um, it's not gonna lock out for you. So it's very sensitive, but also once it locks down, it's nice and stable. And then the reason they call it the Pro Flex is because your, your, your third finger and your fourth finger, which I don't like that you have to purchase the fourth finger separately. I wish, especially for this price tag, everything came inside the package altogether. I think that should be included. But both of those, if you loosen that nut, that's going to be able to adjust forwards and backwards. And again, give you that, that really flexible comfortability um, that each of us varies. So again, customizing these releases I think is so important. The more I've shot different releases, index finger and thumb, the more you realize that they are just drastically different as we are as hunters and being able to customize them to the feel that you like, I think is, is, is very important since this is one of the most important pieces of the package. Uh, I talk about this all the time, but I think your release um, and your bow, they go hand in hand. It ha you know, it, it's an extension of your arm. It has to feel the most comfortable. Comfortability transfers into consistency, which is what we're all trying to get. And then you have a nice wide range of tension and travel. If you rotate this bolt clockwise, you're going to decrease the travel. If you rotate it counterclockwise, you're going to increase the travel. And for the tension, counterclockwise is going to make it more sensitive. Clockwise is going to make it a little stiffer. Something else that I love about when making your adjustments on the tension and the travel, so it says lock. So right here on the side, there's a lock screw that you'll undo before making your adjustment. Okay, same um, here. So you have this lock, little screw that you'll undo, make your adjustment and then you tighten them back down just to make sure that nothing moves. At this price range, and you've seen me do a couple of these higher price releases, these thumb releases, um, you're gonna get the thumb barrel rotations, you're gonna get the quality of the actual release, the mechanism itself, and then you're gonna get a nice wide range of travel and tension. I think it comes down to comfortability, and we are all so different. Uh, I love that we have some different options here, but after going through some of these higher price thumb releases, 
for some reason, this is the one that I seem to pick up the most. Again, when you have the option of having so many in here, it starts you start noticing more and more which things that you go to just for that simple fact of comfortability. But I do think the quality of this release is exceptional. All of the different um, adjustments is awesome. I wish that fourth finger came in there. I think the hooking mechanism and the way it releases from the string is one of the crispest on the market. It just feels the best to me. And then you have the lanyard, which we've seen some of these higher price releases come without a lanyard. That to me is a no brainer. They go hand in hand. Uh, if you don't want it, you can cut it off, but every single one of these releases should come with a lanyard and a spring clip. I mean, that just, it makes no sense to me why they wouldn't. It's just a nylon string. Uh, for $300, that's guaranteed to be in there. I think the fourth finger should be added as well, but I love that it comes with this really nice lanyard on here that is easily attached to the back of the release. Um, it comes in multiple different colors. It comes in black, you got the silver finish here, and then it comes in a purple one. This is definitely right in there in the investment category. If you're looking to invest in a nice release, I would get out and shoot a couple of these before you purchase one. You have a couple really nice options. Go back and look at the other ones that we've we've done and reviewed. You will see that they're all very similar, but in their, in their own individual way, they're very different. And one of them I think would stand out more to you. This right now seems to be my favorite out of all the ones that we've shot. There is nothing better to me than investing yourself in a nice, nice release that you feel comfortable with and it's gonna get you those consistent shots downrange. Hit the links below, check it out yourself. See you next time.